Hi, I'm Kevin Harrington, an original shark from the hit TV show Shark Tank. I'm here with Corey Zygman. Corey, welcome. We're going to talk about entrepreneurship. And you came out of an entrepreneurial family, much like myself, your, your father and your mother in the, in the restaurant business. You got into the nightclub business. You've been doing a lot of philanthropy, building schools all over the place. Uh, congratulations on that. But now you're an online entrepreneur. Tell me about that. This is a new move for you, but it's pretty exciting. Such a new move. Yeah, I yeah. love it. Um, I was running one of my other businesses very lightly online. And, you know, we had this website that I kind of put together by myself. Terrible. Um, and a friend of mine in March introduced me to this business. And she was like, I just think you'd be a perfect fit. I think this could be a good thing for you. Can you go to Australia in three days? And I was like, you know, I did as much research as I could in 24 hours. And I was like, absolutely. Made the decision. It looked like something that I would be involved in and uh, took the leap and have decided to to run an online business which is not what I ever thought I would do. So how has this changed your life? You probably don't have those late hours uh, that you used to have in the nightclub business, huh? No, but the cool thing is is I can run this anywhere in the world. Uh, I, like. I travel all over the world, I love to travel, I love to serve, I, whether it's in the States or international, and I like that this business is 24 hours anywhere. So. It, if I want to be up late, it's fine. If I want to be up early, it's fine too. You kind of set your own hours. You get a chance to meet a lot of people. You're traveling multiple countries now. And of course, um, you, you, you live in the LA area. Australia is, is quite, a, quite a ways to go, but you probably had a lot of fun when you were down there, I'll bet. Too, I right? ended up on a 28 day vacation. I did Australia. I went diving in Cannes. I went to Bali. I went to Shanghai. Yeah, I, I just went on vacation. <laughs> wow, this is great. Look at the online business is good to you, huh? So what do you attribute some of the um, success and, and what kind of things have you been learning along the way here? Well, what I like is that I am a very system-based person. I found being a Lone Ranger has never worked for me. Right. Uh, and I think with this, I've seen a lot of opportunities in my life and I've been really good at shiny object syndrome. I've, I've probably purchased everything you could purchase. But then once I really learned like that everything didn't work, I kind of had to see, is this an opportunity for me? And what I liked about this business is it has a lot of systems. I wanted to plug into something that people had tried, people had built, people had created, um, and that was ready to go. I just, I didn't want to reinvent a wheel in an online business. It just doesn't work. I like that. So you, it's sort of like you, your parents come out of the, the they're, they're in a franchising business. They have owned Subway uh, sandwiches uh, chain and what a success that's been. And so they have systems, they have branding, they have um, techniques and, and follow what we um, have put together because we've learned how to do it. And so this is kind of what you're doing in the online space, which is pretty cool. I, I really like that. So um, the systems that you follow, they, do you get a chance to do some of your own testing inside of that? Um, so you get to kind of get, this is where the entrepreneur meets the, the, the systems kind of thing, right? I do. I found with online marketing, there's, there's several different avenues that you can use online and even you can still offline um, with online marketing, advertise things. And I've been very creative in trying to come up with different ideas and ways to be able to get the messages out and be able to introduce people to systems and help them wherever they are and whatever level of life they are. Yeah, so you, you get to take products that are working already, take systems that surround those products and add your little magic dust to it and there you go, you got a nice success formula, so. Yeah, I don't need to touch the products. The products are beautiful. That's why the system is beautiful. But it, again, in being an entrepreneur, you get to, the way to get the product out there has been the entrepreneurial space that I love so much. So Corey, is there anything you'd like to ask me? I'd like to ask you a little bit about time management, balancing family. I mean, as a successful entrepreneur, you know, you have family and you have business and you have a million people tugging at you. Um, how do you balance your time management? That's a great question and I appreciate that. Um, I think, First of all, I think people have to put everything that is necessary for a healthy life, um, your personal time, your private time, your, your time with the kids, time with your wife, family, vacations. I put it all on a calendar. And so uh, if I'm gonna have dinner, if I'm gonna have, just yesterday I did a, a charity walk and it was on my calendar for three months in advance. I schedule everything uh, around my business life and my personal life all on a calendar. And so I put my personal uh, events on there, I put my private events, my, my family events, my business events, and just yesterday I was at a, 
uh, a, a charity event and it was on there for three months and I made sure that was something very special for my wife that I was going to be there. And so even with two kids, I have a 27 year old and a 17 year old, I make sure that they're on my calendar because everybody uh, needs to have t time spent for fulfilling uh, your own needs, their needs, etc. But I make sure that I calendar vacations and time with the family and as well as business because a lot of times people yes oh I got this appointment this appointment this appointment but it's so important to make sure that you're fulfilling the rest of, of the requirements and needs of, of your of your family and your life also well it's fabulous it's great having you here today um, uh, online entrepreneurship is is one of the newer things when I was a young entrepreneur we didn't even have this so as an older entrepreneur I'm now seeing that there's so much uh, potential online and it's good to see you've moved from restaurants and nightclubs and yeah, you probably still dabble a little bit there but into some new avenues of, of revenue generation and uh, it's great to spend some time with you and thanks for being here today as, an, as a, a new age online entrepreneur. Great to have you Corey. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for your time.